There have been mixed reactions at St. Paul's Junior High School over the hot meal provided by government for GHS students. While some say the meal fell below the expectations, others were content with, while some others blamed the caterers. The students also questioned why the food came in branded parts of the NPP parliamentary candidate for Tamale. It's not really how we expected it to be. Where you expecting? We expected it to be a little bit attractive, but when we saw it, we 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 were we weren't really happy about it. Yes, we. Nice. For me, it's not. But the salt content is very low, and you know, I I didn't really I didn't really have the appetite to eat it. Yes. Right. Because it wasn't attractive. <laughs> we weren't expecting this type of food. Wow, yes. Like something nice, attractive, like. but like you see when you go to buy fried rice, the way it's attractive. But this one is like a mutu rice box. <laughs> eh, it's not attractive. Yes. Eh, we don't blame the president, we blame the cookers. So, Nanado should talk to them and they'll cook palatable food for us. Uh, the food, it's not, it's not all that good, but because if you see, that it's, the food is not even many. And uh, the way they, they package, if you see, you think the food is good, but it's not good. The water itself, the water is not even cool, it's hot. Hot water, but they say hot meal. The, we expected something better than this one. The food itself is not all that good. And, they, they put and how can, and you see, the, as the, the branding of it, you shouldn't add politics into like serving food to children. These are children for crying out loud. We, we are children. We, don't, we are not supposed to be added into, put into politics. Meanwhile, schools in the Somba district of the northern region are yet to receive their meals two days after the food distribution started. At the Sabuba DA Junior High School, several of the students said they came to school on an empty stomach because they were expecting to be fed. We received it, and I'd like to appeal to the leaders that they should chill and help us. But as we, or uh, since yesterday to now, as we came to school, we didn't eat. But we said they were going to prepare a hot meal for us. We didn't eat anything when we came. And they try and let us get it. What I have to tell the leader is they should try and give us the food because we will be suffering. If I go to school sometimes, some of our parents are very poor. And some of, our, some of us are also orphans. So if I go to school, we don't have money to buy anything. Far we had a friend. Before we hear the president will be giving us some, we we're very happy. But by the end, we were disappointed. And what I have to tell the leader is they should try and let us get the food. The headmaster of the school appealed to the authorities to make the meals available. As you have said, we all heard in the 15th address of the president and that the junior high school students and the teachers respectively will be provided with one hot meal. But as of today, uh, the 20, uh, the 25th of August, uh, we have not seen an issue yet. At least around 12, uh, 15, and we'll also be closing at 1 o'clock. But as I speak now, we have not seen anything. But we are expecting that uh, we would have gotten something as of now for both the students and then the people, most especially the students. Yeah, basically, we can only appeal to those in authority, and most especially uh, those in the Saboba area, because. Uh, we have realized that some of our colleagues elsewhere in the, in the regional capital and other parts of the regions like Upper East and Upper West, but we are in the northern region, so I, we can speak about Tamale Metro. Some of them have benefited. So we are appealing to authorities in Saboba to try as much as they can to make sure that these students especially get this means so that uh, it will enhance our work in the school. 